you've heard of the Kanuri people, their marriage tradition is such that captures the eyes of many. In fact, for some, it's here say that most Kanuri parents receive gold coin as dowry before a union is sailed. Well, Abdul Malik Hassan will tell us the story of Shehu Musayaradua, son of late President Umar Musayaradua, who traveled down to Meduguri for his long time heartthrob. 24 gold coin. It is not something most people are used to during marriages. But to the Kanuri people, it is a tradition upheld while performing marriage rites. These gold coins are presented here as dowry to seal the union between Shehu Musa Yaradwa and Yasin Muhammad Nur. <laughs> Marriage consummated, they are now husband and wife. Chris crossing from Medjugorje to Abuja, Medina holds to celebrate the union. Beautifully dressed and walking into the well decorated space, the joy is overwhelming. And friends of the groom and bride, it's the whole world. Indeed, it is a moment to be old. Taking this change, the couple shared a moment. <laughs> then, cutting up the wedding cake, the <laughs> first lady of Nigeria, Aisha Bahari, presided here. Not to forget the delicious delicacies served and advice from guests. <laughs> I'm particularly happy to join my family because the other dog brought me to Abuja, so I'm a part of the person of the family. There's no secret to a happy marriage other than the fact that he is not into a marriage to is to become each other best friends and best cousins. In this case, communication is the Their union will be an eternal and pleasant one in their life. I would therefore wish to advise Shehu and his lovely bride that they have to learn to live, to love, to be happy, and to persevere. I wish they a very successful marriage. I know the young man will have the calmness of his father, and the young girl appear to be very stable. To witness this day, this is a day of joy. This is a day of celebration. But more importantly, it's also a day for us as well wishes to lead the young couple and pray to the Almighty Allah to guide their every conduct in the future. Indeed. President Umar Musa Yaradwa lives on, and Shehu and Yasin hold the baton up high in matrimony.